Hello guys, this is Mauro from GreenFoodTech.com and in this video I just want to show you a quick tour of the uh, newly released apps uh, for Office 2016 and we're going to look at uh, Word, PowerPoint and Excel. These are the, um, the touch optimized apps that Microsoft will be releasing uh, later this year and today anyone running Windows 10 which is the requirement can install the uh, the preview version of the apps and test them and you can see everything that's new you can actually uh, use it with your uh, uh, touch enable device though the apps are currently not available for tablets or phones so the uh, the version that you get in today is the one for your desktop running Windows 10 so if you want to try them out you can download them right now I created a, uh, a post with the links I'm gonna leave the uh, the link on the uh, on the video notes and when once you are in the post just click the uh, uh, the link for the app that you want to download and it will take you straight to the uh, Microsoft page to download and it will also pop up the uh, this this window asking you to open the app uh, to to get to the download page, but on the uh, on the store beta that Microsoft is building for Windows 10. Once you're there, just click Allow, and it will take you right to the uh, new uh, App Store for uh, for Microsoft, and you can download the app like uh, right there. Um, I already installed it. I don't know what it's showing to install, but everything is in beta, so things might not work as uh, as expected. But you can click install and and it will, uh, it, it will install. As you can see, I already have it installed, so it showed up. It didn't actually went through the installation process. Okay, so let me show you really quick how these uh, apps looks like. And this is the um, uh, the interface. It looks similar to what you see today on iOS and Android. You, uh, but on the desktop, you can minimize and maximize. Uh, you you can get uh, some of the features and one thing I have been noticing is that um, you will get the uh, light version of uh, Word, Excel and PowerPoint for free but then if you want other features you will be required to have a uh, Office 365 uh, pay subscription for example if I want to change the orientation right now if I click there it will ask me that this feature is uh, in Office 365 and you need a subscription so you can click there and actually subscribe and and get the full uh, the full version um, all the features that you get today are all the basics to do doc uh, to to create documents and and presentations or uh, Excel uh, sheets and as you can see let me show you right now uh, this is from Windows uh, 8.1 as you can see like all uh, word on Windows 8.1 has a lot more tons of uh, other features and the one that that you, uh, that you have right that we have right now for uh, for touch doesn't have as many so this is still under development so Microsoft is going to be adding more features as as we as we go as we move along and closer to the uh, to the release to the release date so let me just uh, show you really quick that we also have uh, reading mode you can switch to reading mode which hides all the uh, elements uh, for editing you can actually uh, get to the uh, uh, file and uh, read written without distractions and you can go back just click in the menu and click editing and you go back to editing so we have some options here to clear formatting uh, to add in bullets, uh, numbering, and a bunch of other uh, options, and heading, and you you get the idea. Also, we get a uh, search, a search um, that you can do basic search on the uh, on on the document. Like, let me see, news letter. You can see this as a search, and there is not much to see. More than the layout has changed a little, uh, has changed 
compared to what we see today on Windows, but it remains the same throughout different devices that we used to. Uh, we also have the uh, uh, tell me and tell me what to do. So, um, so you can uh, you can ask anything, but uh, it will also get the insights, which is powered by Bing, and it will help you to get stuff done. And all right, so let's let me show you the uh, Excel, which all pretty much are the uh, the same uh, at this time right now. They don't have many uh, many features. But let me see. Uh, we got shapes. We got different ribbons. You can maximize it. Or like if you want to use a snap, I guess it's not letting me do that. Uh, it's, it's it's letting me snap, but you can't snap more than two apps. Like if you see, like if I try to resize it, you will stuck right there. So okay, let's go back to the um, to Excel. So let me see. You can create your functions. You can add formulas, formulas, and you can review. There is not too many options, and you can view, and you got a view tab with some options there. This is um template I downloaded to show you how everything looks like and everything uh, you'll see it's more optimized for for touch so the menus and items uh, look bigger so it's uh, easier for uh, for your fingers and let me see you can settings if you try to like it to the settings uh, you will get the uh, fly out menu but they don't work so we know that the uh, charms are going away and the fly out menu is going away and as we know the uh, office is still under development so we don't have access to uh, any any of the uh, the settings we get the, the button to upgrade so we can get office 365 which we're not going to do that right now and we can share with uh, onedrive or choose a different location let me see onedrive if that works we're syncing the file please well to share and so here we can share it with some other people. We get messages this way right now, as you can see right here. And that's pretty much it from the uh, uh, from Excel. And let me show you really quick the uh, PowerPoint, which is uh, will look a lot similar to what you see today on Windows, but the apps are pretty much the same as an iOS and Android so like if we get to settings we get the same thing and we can get to the settings we get the, the home tab with some uh, layouts and things you can do there to, to create your presentations you can insert uh, tables picture shapes text box and you can add new slices transitions you got a few of them you can get even more right here and we get the uh, a slideshow mode, so you can choose your slideshow, you can review and add, uh, and show some markup and show comments, and then we just get uh, some basics, uh, um, uh, functions. I mean options to uh, to view your presentations. You can even click right here to start the slideshow, and it will the full screen, but it doesn't go actual full screen, and you can use ink and other tool and black screen and end the slideshow so that's pretty much um, how the apps looks like right now uh, if you're testing uh, windows 10 i would recommend you to test the uh, uh, the apps so it will help microsoft to like make the uh, these applications better and be ready uh, before the end of the year probably and i'm just uh I uh, hope this video was informative for you and I want to thank you for viewing.